Bismillah Rahman Rahim. So now we'll start our class. Al Wahdatul Rabia, fourth unit, Al Hayatul Yomiya, and daily life. Al Dazu Wahid was a lesson. Thirty first lesson. Mufrada Kunizafia, additional vocabulary. Al Ard presentation. Unzur was the main wide look and listen and repeat. Today we'll study the ordinal numbers for masculine. Today we'll start the ordinal numbers for masculine. So al awal means first. It is for male only. Asani for second male, second position, male only. So if any one of you wants to read, then raise her hand. Nobody wants to read, okay? So, okay, Fatu Bintu Kamala wants to read. Read it. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Al awal. Al thani. Al thalis. Al arba. Al arba. Al rabi. Al Rabi, okay. Al Khamis. Good. At the dream of first exercise, Rati Bil Adad, arrange the numbers. So he's asking you to arrange the numbers. So you just arrange them. You will, Al Awal is written here. You will write Asani here. You will write Asalis here, Al Rabi, Al Khamis. In this way, you will write it and then you will submit it to Google Classroom. I hope it will be easy for you. Then Atadri Bussani, second exercise. Silbainal Adadi Water Tibihi. Connect the number with its position. So you just join the num digit form of number with the word. Then Atadri Bussalis. Ikrail Adada Tertibian. Read the ordinal numbers. So Raise your hand. If anyone wants to read, okay, Miss Satya, read in them. First, unmute yourself, then start. Yeah, um, Assalamu alaikum. Wa uh, this three three mean salasa salasa mean three but we need a ordinal number which is third uh, as salasa as salis okay as salis okay as salis then fifth Al Kamis, correct. Uh, first Al Awal, <coughs> fourth, fourth Arba, Al Rabi, Al Rabia, mm, second Asani, correct. Atadribu Rabi Sil Bainal Adadi was Surah Til Munasiba. He's asking us to join the number with the appropriate picture. So you'll just join them with the picture. Here you see the fifth one is highlighted. So you'll join the fifth position with Al Khamis. Here you will see the fourth position is highlighted. So you will join the fourth position with Al Rabi. So in this way you will join them and submit it to Google Classroom. Then al Wadatul Rabia, fourth unit, al Hayatul Yomiya, daily life, at the Susani, Wasalasun, at the Rakibul Nahviya, at the Dribul Awal, the Badalis Suala, Wal Jawaba, Mazmidika, Kamafil Misal.
المثال دي اكزامبل الطالب الاول متى تذهب الى المدرسه when do you go to the school الطالب الثاني اذهب الساعه السابعه i go at seven o'clock so madrasa has kasra because of this preposition this preposition has given it kasra tazhabu you go azhabu i go mata mean when so asa tells us about the time of verb so that's why it has fata with it sabia means seven o'clock asa to sabia seven o'clock now i need two students raise your hand okay miss satya you are first student and miss khatija you are second student read it mata tazabu ila al madrasati adhab adhabu saata saata sabia i go to school at 7 o'clock mata tazabu ila al baiti اذهب الى بيتي آه الى بيتي الساعه واحدة. in the first thing is اذهب okay اذهب then you want أذهب. to say اذهب الى البيت is not needed here because it is understood by her question where she is asking about house and you are answering about the house so you are okay. all home so you will just see as habu saat al wahida as habu saat al wahida now look at an example for a moment here you see seen as shadda so you need to join ba with sa as habu saat al wahida as habu saat tus wa saat al wahida saat al wahida okay Okay. Um, mata tazhabu ila tabibi. Adhabu saatu thaniya. Saatu thaniya. Fata. Saatu thaniya. Ah, mata tazhabu ila almasjid. اذهبوا ساعه ساعه سابعه اذهبوا ساعه ثلاثه اذهبوا ساعه الثالثه اذهبوا اذهبوا ساعه الثالثه ساعه الثالثه Salisa. Salisa. Good. Read it again. Adhabu saya tus salisa. Good. Now, Miss Khatija, you are first, and Miss Satya, you are second student. Mata, mata adhabu ila ila muhindis. الى المهندس اوكي الى المهندس اذهب الساعه اذهب الرابعه متى تذهب الى الى الشقه اذهب Ashabus Saatal Khamis Ashabus Saatal 
Tal kamisa. Right. Mata tatabu ilal ammu. Ilal ammi. Ilal ammi. Oh yeah. Kasra. Ashabu sa disa. Asata sa disa. Okay. Next. التدريب الثاني تبادل السؤال والجواب مع زميلك كما في المثال المثال الطالب الأول أين تسل الفجر؟ Where do you pray the fajr؟ الطالب الثاني أصلي الفجر في المسجد I pray fajr in the mosque or in the masjid so to salli mean you pray, to salli I pray. In both sentences, fajr has fatta because it is telling us about the time of the verb. So in the picture, in each picture, you have verb with you salli yakra. You salli mean he reads. You need it to convert into you read. You salli he reads. To salli you read. To salli I read. Similarly, in the next one, Yakrau, he reads. So you just replace Ya with Ta, it will become Takrau. Takrau, you read. Then you, you will replace the Ya with Hamza, it will become Akrau, I read. Yushahidu, he watch. He watches. Tushahidu, you watch. Ushahidu, I watch. So in this way, you will convert the verb in all of these pictures. Now raise your hand. So Miss Kinza is saying in the question the word is you suddenly no. In the question you need to ask the question to second person. If you ask the question Aina <clears throat> Yusalli Fajra, then this will mean where does he pray the Fajr? So if you ask the question, Aina Yusalil Fajra, where does he pray the Fajr? We need to ask, where do you pray the Fajr? Similarly, in the answer, I will say, I pray, not he pray or you pray. <coughs> okay, next we have... Okay, Miss Saima, you are first student and Miss Rina, you are second student. Okay. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Aina taqra ul Qur'ana. Aqra ul Qur'an fi musalli. Fil musalla. This is Alif Muqsura. Not him. Aqra ul Qur'ana fil musalla. Aqra'ul Qur'ana fil musalla. Aina tushahidu tilfaza. Usahidu tilfaja fil gurfati. Aina tatawadda'u. Atawadda'u fil hamami. No, Miss Yelena, you are first. Miss Saima, you are second. Okay. Aina, um, Aina, just a minute. Aina to silul at Baco. Aina to silul at Baco, okay. Or silul at Baco, feel mad Baco. Aina Tanamu. أنام في غرفة النوم. أين تغسل الملابس؟ أغسل الملابس في الحمام. If anyone wants to ask question, she can ask me. No question, so we'll proceed. التدريب. Yeah, I have a question, teacher. I'm writing. Yes, Miss Amin Abdiasan, ask. 
Yeah, I wanted to you to repeat uh, he's watching. Okay. He's watching TV. So he's watching TV means you shahidu. You shahidu till you shahidu. You shahidu. You ya mean he. You shahidu till faza means okay. he is watching TV. Okay. Tulfa. Tilfaza. Tilfada. Yes. He is watching that TV. Okay, thank you. Anyone else? Aina Yusali Fajr. What is the answer? Okay. If you are saying Aina Yusali Fajr, this means where does he pray Fajr? Okay, this question is not required here. In this dialogue, we need to ask, where do you pray the Fajr? So, for this question, you say, Aina to Salil Fajra, and its answer is, Usalil Fajra, Film Majidi. <clears throat> I pray the Fajr in the Masjid. No, I am talking about you, Sali. I am not talking about I and you. Okay. I mean, you. Okay, so if you want to ask me about any person, let's say Ahmad, you want to ask me about Ahmad and you say, Aina Yusallil Fajra, where does he pray Fajr? Then I will say, Yusallil Fajra fil Masjidi, he pray Fajr in the Masjid. So in the answer, I will say Yusalli for that question. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. So Al Wadatu Rabia Tadribu Salis Al Misalul Awal first example Tolibul Awal Maza Tafalu What are you doing? A Talibusani Akra Ul Kurana I am reading the Quran. So Yakra U he is reading. We need to change this question to Akrao. Akrao mean I am reading. Tafalu mean you are doing. Akrao mean I am reading. So Tafalu is for male only. In case of female, we say Al Misal Usani Atalibatul Ula. First female student. Maza Tafalina. What are you doing? So for to male, Tafalu, Takrao, Tusali, Taktubu. But to female, we say Tafalina, Takraina, Taktubina, Takraina, Tusalina, like this. We add Ya Noon. Atolibatus Sania, second female student, Akra Ul Qurana, I am reading the Holy Quran. Then here you learn that Takrau, Tusalli, Tushahidu is for male, second person. But you also need to remember that Takrau also means she is reading. Takrau, Taktubu, Tushahidu means she is reading, she is watching, things like this. So Takrau has two meanings. Tushahidu has two meanings. So words like these have two meanings. If anyone has a question, she can ask me. No question, so I need two students. Uh, who... uh, just a minute. Yes. Excuse yes. me. Yes. Uh, for female, the word to shahidu or to shahidina. Okay, depend on the female. If a female is second person, I mean, I mean a female which is standing, who is standing in front of you, then you will say, takraina, tafalina, to shahidina, taktubina. But if a female is not in front of you, she is absent, she is third person, then you will say Takrau, Tafalu, Taktubu, Tusalli. Okay. Okay, Miss Kinza. Okay. Now I need two students. Raise your hand. Miss Amin Abdi Hassan. You are first student and Miss Khatija, you are second student. 
read the example. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. What do you do? I read the Quran. What do you do? Tafalina. Next question is Maza Tafalina. Maza Tafalina. Okay, Maza Tafalina. Akra ul Quran. Next. Maza Yah. Sorry, what? Repeat. So this one I will include Maza. Yes, you will ask him what are you doing. Okay. Maza tafalu. Tafalu mean you are doing. Maza tafalu. Okay, maza tafalu. What are you doing? Maza tafalu. Maza tafalu. Um. Afalu. No, afalu mean I am doing. You will not say I am doing. You will just say I am sweeping. Ak aksunu aksunu rufa. Ak no sul rufa ta. Ak no sul rufa ta. Correct. Mada tafalina. Ah. Akshahidun Akshahidut Tilfaza So you will just remove or replace the ta with alif hamza Ushahidut Tilfaza Ushahidut Tilfaza Mada Tafalu Akra Oh, Sahifan. Good. Sahifata. Sahifata, okay. You want to first to learn, Miss Khatija? Mada Tafalu? Yakfi Malabis. No. Akwi. You need to replace Ya with Hamza. Akwil Malabis. Akwil malabis. Mada tafalu? No, she is female. Tafalu is for male. Okay, we're doing female now. Mada tafalina? Taqsilu? Taqsilu means you are washing. You need to say I am washing. So how should I say? You will just re re replace the ta with Hamza. Aqsilul atbaka. I am washing the plates. Aqsilul. Yes. Aqsilul. Aqsilul. Atbaka. Aqsilul atbaka. As as Aqsilul atbaka. Nice. No, we have a male. Look at the picture. This is a boy. Oh, sorry. Mada Tafalu. Urfun Kitabin. Sorry, no. Wrong answer. Try again. Wrong answer, yeah. Sorry. Let me try again. Akra ul kitaba. I am reading the book. Okay. So it's not changing when I'm talking about myself when I'm saying akru. Yes. Let Let us solve this. Let us do this question again. I need two more students. Okay. Raise your hand. I need two students, okay? Miss Amina and Miss Kinza. Miss Amina, you will be the first student and Miss Kinza, you all will be the second student. So let me tell you again. Yakrao means he is reading. 
So tafalu mean you are doing akrau. I am reading in the picture. You will ask the question to the man or woman who you will see in the picture, and he will answer you. Let's say I am. I see this man. I will ask him, "What are you doing?" So the first student will ask him this question, "What are you doing?" And second student will uh, reply as him. So he will, he will say, "I am sweeping the room." So the second student will give us this answer that I am sweeping the room. So start now. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullah. Wa alaikum assalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. ماذا تفعل؟ أقرأ القرآن. ماذا تفعلين؟ أقرأ القرآن. ماذا تفعل؟ أكنت الغرفة. ماذا تف؟ no, Tafalu is for male and we see a lady in the picture. Oh, sorry, I didn't see. Mother Tafalina? Correct. Ushahibu till father. Mother Tafalu? Now, Miss Kinza, you are first student, and Miss Amina is second. Maza Taf Alu Akwi Akwil Malabis. Malabisa Maza Taf Alina. Um. أغسل الأطباق ماذا تفعل؟ أقرأ الكتابة Okay, so if anyone has any questions, she can ask me now. Yes, السلام عليكم. Um, I have a question related to what we just did. Yes. I thought that we were. I thought you explained that tafalu was the same for male and female when we're saying, "What are you doing?" Okay, got it. Is that right? That but one good. of the questions I had to ask, Mother Tafalina, what is she doing? No. Is I got confused. Okay. Do you all see the whiteboard? Yes. Okay, good. So <clears throat> I will say he is reading. Can you tell me the Arabic of this? Yaktubu. Yakrau. Yakrau, okay. Sorry, Yakrau, sorry. Now we need to say she is reading. Takrau. Takrau. Okay. Okay. Yes. Sorry. Yeah. So yakrau mean he is reading and takrau she is reading. Now I will say you for male are reading. What will I say? Just give any answer, don't make a mistake. So your answer? Takrau. Takrau. Now I want to say you female are reading. Takraina. Takraina. Okay, its spelling can be changed according to person. 
it very but don't worry we will not go in the detail of spelling at the moment of this takla ina or you can remove this and the hamza from you can leave it then i want to say i am reading akra u okay akra u so we have learned these five words so far so miss amina look here she is reading and you male are reading are absolutely the same no difference okay oh, she and you okay she and you I mean, same but in case of female takraina different word different spelling he is different now miss amina you will change yeah. this word akrao which word you have studied so far oxil okay he is washing uh yaqsilu yaqsilu okay she is washing taqsilu taqsilu you male are washing um tag uh tag silu okay yeah tag silu yeah so i have made a mistake here. it is tag silu okay you female are washing um tag silina correct i am washing ah silu i made mistake okay correct so taxilina taxilina and auxilu yeah okay any question from anyone if anyone has any question she can ask me I think Miss Kinza wants to ask us something. No question, so we'll stop.